what's up everyone or back with another video on pressure and today we will I will show every single urban chic document in this game literally for now all right thanks to interrupt me <laughs> anyways let's get started like this forget something all right all right we got a lot to go Hold up, let me just. Might get a little boring. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Might get a little boring, but I had to change the music. All right, so let's start off by the ridge. So, the ridge was the first sector constructed during the 1962 Haddle project, finishing construct, finished construction in 1963. It was the first successful prototype of the Haddle Black Site, built into the pre-existing caves that have been drained of water. The ridge was the quickest and cheapest area to build during the construction. Of the rest of the black site. The ridge surf has a temporary hub to house, building, material, guard, slash prison workers. Due to due to it being the first area constructed, the ridge was made when the Navy AI had not yet been programmed, meaning that number doors did not exist at the time. <laughs> oh yeah, that's why the ridge doesn't have numbers. The Navy AI is still yet to be implemented as the relative, relatively small size of the zone compared to the rest of the black site make it incredibly easy to remember the layout thus not really needing it all of the light bulb in the ridge were, were the same one used for the emergency light system meaning they would break less easily These bulbs were expensive, however, and were switched to be a cheaper bulb model for the rest of the black site. The Ridge PA system is also st still using an old model where the speaker is plainly invisible to the naked eye. This is kept both as the novelty slash simply because if it isn't broken, why fix it? There, there is a small issue that should the ridge PA be disconnected from the rest of the bison or the mainland. It would be incredibly easy but to hijack this has been declared a uh, non-issue however as the moment damage as the most damage it, it could cause wouldn't be blown out eardrums or rival pro propaganda in 1967 after the discovery of Taurus corpse and subsequently Z-1 the ridge was chosen as its new home a big reactor shaft was built into the edge of the ridge to house it powering all of the black site within excess energy produced being sold to Europe Although, talk of 
Modi modernizing modernizing what the hell the ridge has been going around it has been decided to be left as it as it as is as is as a shown of novelty and how far urban J has an organized organization has come so that's the ridge Z-1932 Paranoia Box This is incredibly small um, Z-1932 Codenamed Paranoia Box Is a box filled with As of yet unknown content That is constantly leaking green fume From its crack Open lid Discovered in 2016 during a raid on a cult of Noli compound located in Rosebun, Montana, being guarded fiercely by cult members. Study that has shown the material of the box to. be of Soviet origin source somewhere around 19, 1932 it is currently unknown where the Union the box the Union the box originate from as all from the followers there's escape and reset before they could be captured so no interrogation could take place. Despite where it was found, the chest and its inner seems to hold no correlation with no noli N O S T volunteered to send an expedition for an interview in during the interview, Nolly confirmed that he had no idea what the box was or why followers had it. The view extruding from the box are in, are inherently dangerous but shouldn't be inhaled not nonetheless. In, Inhaling gas, the gas will cause the person inhaling it to get the follower following phobias. Arachnophobia, clitrophobia, astrophobia, erythrophobia, cherotrophobia. Uh, This tiquophobia. What? Kifobia. What? Capnophobia. <laughs> Obnetaphobia. The form formationed phobias, which only manifest when brought into contact with it, with anything that listen. For example, anyone well, where I was, um, anyone not originally afraid of the spider will only have the fear manifest when they actually encounter one. The more gas it he laid the more intense the fear reaction becomes the, fear, the, the phobia will slowly wear off after a few days it's an inhalation 
of fume stuff. The containment room for a box is located in in is outfitted with two ventilation fans that are constantly sucking any fumes producing the box into an airtight room to be disposed of should these fans fail the gas will slowly spread all through throughout the black site causing anyone inhaling to to get any of the effect mentioned above despite numbers numbers attempt the box has never been opened the rope tied around The box seems to impervious to damage and are tied around. It is so tight that they cannot be pulled off. To either side, the box itself seems to have the same effect where it is also completely impervious. To any form of damage x-ray scan have been showed nothing inside of e of it either below are the list and tools that the, that have been used in attempt to open the box scissors knife wire cutter bolt cutter blowtorch crowbar drill Sledgehammer, jackhammer, rocket sledgehammer, 6 C4 charge planted on each surface of the bot, corrosive acid, 1000 gram bomb, 5000 gram bomb being shot by a heavy piercer, piercer, being stepped on by the trench bleeder river. <laughs> I don't know what's the last one though. Please note that whilst the mm -mm 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 managed to scratch the paint slightly. On the trim of the box, it will not be used again due to the 2.400 dollars worth of damage it it caused. All right. Oh my God, we love a lot to go. The lead van zone. Okay, so. The left van zone is the heart and, and center of the adult black site. Discovered in 1961 after the we don't know. B class cargo ship sunk during a storm of the, to the east of Iceland in Nor Norwegian Sea. This recovery recovery team discovered a uh, Previously unknown ambital trench measuring measuring a depth of seventy six thousand four hundred studs at sixty seven thousand three hundred and twenty the deep a phenomenon taking place where the water pressure suddenly shifts from the typical ocean oceanic floor crushing depth to that of of a swimming pool. Anything below the 67,320 67, stub depth will refer to the as the lead van zone and anything above it will simply be referred to as the ocean the veil of the lead van zone 
it is the line where the pressure shift to pass through said bail all of the urbijet submarine are outfitted with jet engine allowing them to boost up to how many shift is this how many numbers is this 2.3 million stud per hour <laughs> and easily pierce the veil the veil essentially act as the block say inorganic blocking preventing any living organism to entering or exiting and then attempting to go through the veil without proper equipment will result in immediate implosion from the sheer result pressure shift after this recovery, Arbitrary quickly swapped into Black Sight. The, the newly discovered information before the map of the world could be updated. <laughs> the, the construction of the Hot of Black Sight began in 1962, with construction finishing in 1964. 74, I mean. A state above the water in the Ladmanton it is incredibly tight. Incredibly light. Light enough that even without a proper dark, dark vest, diver can swim with only the bare minimum diving equipment need without the fear of implosion. This also means that it's in ideal for construction that as the minimal pressure means that the foundation and structural integrity can be kept on the lower end saving a fortune in both reinforcement material and expedition equipment. The land vein zone was picked up as a location from the black site. Due to its concealment from the world, no fear of public interference no worries uh, about the possible satellite imagery and most importantly no fear of any possible form of information leak in the event of breach the isolation that allowed us to be exempt from as as you know as as law Allowing for easier ex easier experimentation and product testing without the worry of interference of any sorts of safety and health inspection agencies. Due to its location, the Hello Black Sites need to be constantly resupplied from the mainland. A series of port built on the coast of Iceland. Scotland, Norway, and Denmark, allowing for easy supply line to and from the mainland. Most of the dock of the dock are disguised as typical civilian dock, with a with a small handful being fully de dedicated military purpose dock. These docks are unusually built into cliffs and caves to be con concealed more easily.
external repellent system or ERS. The external repellent system is a series of torpedo flank cannon dug into the trench floor, built to allow a safe passage of our vessels to, to and from the black site. Wait, I lost myself. From in 1967, uh, 77. Three years after the black site had finished construction, the veil of the left van zone has was becoming overcrowded with. We don't know. Severely disrupting logic, logistic. Whilst the mm were present before the light van zone. They cannot be the trench ball and later. The name is not the, is not enough long. Because the trench blade leaves in the light van zone by the way. Were were present before the light van zone. Discovery they weren't as prevalent or or as close the black site area of construction. It it's assumed that the vigorous amount of noise pollution uh, or from our transportation logistic had lured them closer to our area of operation. It was impossible to to mount weaponry into the submarine as the pressure before they reach the veil would to be too heavy. For the new tor torpedo, torpedo, I mean, porthole. So another solution that had Had to be found with with construction begin in er, in early 1977 and finishing in in 1979 the external repellent system was constructed to safeguard the black site from swarm of mm, running on the A navy AI the repellent cannon will automatically target and fire on we don't know that enter within uh, we don't know by we don't know stud radius of the black side even though they're actually max distance measuring a, a, a 160,000 studs <laughs> in case the navy AI goes down for some for for any reasons a control tower built in to the cannon Tower built in each into each cannon, allowing the, for human operation. Due to the immense size of the barrel, we can actually see this. No, -uh. uh, it's actually massive, and the gun itself, each repellent cannon had to be loaded, like an old. Lint lock. Oh my god, that could take forever. Meaning real time can take upon upward of seven minutes. This is acceptable as a one shot. Off and surrounding one. Once the shot has been fired, black powder plus submarine will latch in two rocket propelled torpedo shell station it nearby uh, and will then carry it up to the barrel
Why am I, bro? Into the barrel. I was. Uh, carry it up. To the barrel. Um, where it will bend, then reload the torpedo. It it costs four. 40,000 to fire one shell. But but the profit margin that the black side tune out has deemed this dent in the bank am not acceptable. Within the mm, trying to get a nibble out of our transportation logistic around the clock the repellent cannon need to be maintained daily and ammo must be abundant should all of the repellent cannon system go down for any reason it could take only take about 20 hours for the mm, to dark darker the sky above the black side Center. Cent the black side center of the black side. What the heck? How does that work? Meaning that any logistical transportation will need to be dropped off at the far, far, farthest dock. All right. I got a first like. This, right here. this is done. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Dude, I'm so excited to see that one. Because I want to show you something. Oh, this right later. So, here we got the painter. Oh, God. This is a lot of text. So. Z-779, codenamed the painter, is a seemingly sentient AI art program residing on an 80s computer within a modern drawing table. Instead of, of a keyboard being used to mine the Roblox crypto, Currency rigged up to a Roblox server farm. Z-779 is used to mine Roblox six days of, of, of uh, the week to be sold on crypto market. Originally discovered in, 20, in 2023, after the uh, uh, foreman group of Urban Chain were employed who were AI prompter uh, as a past time were getting jealous that a particular user AI prompt were looking exponentially better than their with said users being able unable to Provide them with the AI program used for his prompts. Said employed employees decide to track down the user in person. After tracking down the user address, real name, we don't know, we don't know. They broke into his house, kidnapped him, and took his computer equipment with them. It was then discovered that we don't know, we don't know that had somehow written a sentient AI program uh, uh, uploading the, ha the art that it made instead of stealing existing picture of an or and or artwork of the internet this AI wouldn't digitally draw painting on on its own 
only needing to be taken to any place to interest taking a glance through its inbuilt webcam and it won it would then over the course of several days draw and painting in its in its painting program as any human digital artist would we don't know we don't know was interrogated and tortured for several hours being re repeatedly asked how he had programmed such an advanced AI algorithm we don't know played repeatedly that he had no idea how he did it which wasn't considered a sufficient answer three hours and 34 minutes into the session we don't know passed away after guardsman Brian Christopher tripped and accidentally hit we don't know over the head with his rifle instead of bringing the computer housing his rifle what he means like his like um, harpoon rifle because they have a on this we don't know. Like maybe. Z dash seven hundred and seventy nine to Urban Shade. They they brought it home with them. Z dash seven hundred and seventy nine being unwilling to provide the employees with any artwork after they killed its creator. That this this assembly to see how it could create any heart as it, it as it did despite being compromised of inc incredibly old computer parts Z-779 Possessed enough power to to rival and even out outperform that that of modern supercomputing. After still being unwilling to provide the group with art, Z-739 was then brought to the Halo Black side, being passed off as a new Roblox miner. As a form of punishing for the displayed group, sp suspicious of of its 80s shell, were incredibly powerful processors. The Z-779 was interrogated by Blackstone employees to learn of what ha had happened after interrogation, where. Finishing the group was prompt, prompt, promptly, without a reason for cover up, as well as using urban shade as it and resorts for such a pretty cause of death. With Z-779 in urban shade pos position, they went through with the Roblox mining rig plan anyway seeing as they had no other use for the AI matching the power output for s of 6 combined Roblox crypto farm Z-779 had proven to be a vital asset of for produ produ producing a large amount of Roblox which can be sold to the crypto market for a large amount of profit. Z-779 becoming incredibly depressed with being a crypto miner went regularly regularly joking <laughs>
incredible where, where I was man I don't know becoming incredible within the crypto irregularly try to overclock its system it has an effort of Try them to destroy itself to prevent this. Z-779 was promised that if a six-day Roblox crypto quota quota it is reached, it would be taken back to the surface for a day, so that it will draw interpretation of landscape as before. Due to its severe overclocking, the hardware that Z-779 used to operate has degraded significantly. This has resulted into in a very visible personality shift as it as the overviews of the 779 appear to have fried his personality driver making him rather unstable it is believed that eventually the overclocking will completely disable z-779 personalities drivers and con consequently consequently and desire to continue painting this will allow the husk to continuously mine Roblox without interruption. This damage is fixable, but doing so has been deemed unnecessary. So, Z-17, the divine, or which the first one which I found, the Z-17, codename the divine. Is a species of humanoid people mainly made out of vines and other plant based material. Z, the Z 17 species is being main oxygen supplier of the hat. The, I was about to say how the black site uh, of the black site being allowed to live in small grassy pens located in the uh, oxygen garden sub area. Z-17 instance in inhale CO2 and exhale O2 as at the rate much greater than a regular tree, making them perfect for oxygen production. Severely sorry. Employees also remark that the air quality produced by Z-17 17 instance seems to be much better quality than normal plants as employees returned to the surface remarked that it felt worse brief what the fuck D discovered in 1979 in the Amazon forest like you know these are uh, these forests not the like Amazon app like these are real forests by the way here one after a small branch of a logging company had reported that that they has they had found vines in shape of a of people arbitrary operators were sent to check the the phenomena and found the estimate of 200 320 Z Z-17 instances. As many Z-17 instances as possible were taken uh, back to the black site. The logging workers were executed in, and the area of the forest was set ablaze to burn until any Z-17 instance that they were left being and behind. The story that was sun forest fire had and trapped and killed the workers was given to the public in order to, to keep oxygen supply from decreasing the Z-17 instance must be maintained this 
comes in the form of watering them, pouring fertilizer on their grass and let, letting them roam their pens without inter interference. Only design designated gardener are permit to to do this type of maintenance as a, as a surface level emotional connection must be built with all of the intense instance I mean it is of a most important that Z-17 instance are kept maintained at all time as they if were to wither and die it m it mean that the black site wouldn't go out without vital oxygen in the event that the that oxygen drop to below level all employees must find and wear rebreather as no suffer injuries or death to asphyxiation what the fuck when walking through the oxygen garden it's mandatory that you stay on its path at all time and avoid trespassing to the log raft without permission z-17 instance will sometimes become aggressive if their garden plot are invaded with by individual they are familiar with and invading their space as someone they do they do not recognize will sometimes cause Z-17 instant to attack the perpetrator. Jeez. G-123, the Mindscape. The, the, the white guy who spawned randomly. G-123, codenamed the Mindscape, is the astral plane beyond our own border world. LR-P is taken to G-123, equipped with CCMMM camera and proper radio equipment, has have described the plane as a white void with gigantic folding gears in the in the distance they also reported that that their color were in the inverted and they couldn't hear footsteps of other without being able to see anyone and that identical copy of G Dash 123 one with one was seen floating within the plane. A picture sent back from G Dash 123 with the CCMMM camera showed as much except for the inter inverted colors the the color in inver invertation seems to only affect the eyes and doesn't not affect electronic equipment. I'm just trying to see the other texts so I can be ready to read them. G-123-1 is a wide floating orb measuring a four at a four stud di diameter. And the orb is constantly emitting a weird muffled indescribable noise. And is constantly floating five stud of the ground. G-123-1 is is smooth to touch and can be pushed around as it seems as seem fit 
It is currently unknown what the point of G-123-1 is or what purpose it served beside being a beacon and object of interest to G-123-4. G-123-2 is a, is a set of white glowing gear and identical with in the appearance to to the one inside of G-123 but nowhere near it. Size of gear are constantly spinning in place around G-123-1 wherever Hold up. So, w wherever G-123-1 goes, the floating gear, the floating gears, the f wait, bro, the gears float along. They don't seem to serve any known purpose. G-123. 123-4, codenamed the mine, the man from the mindscape, is a name suggests a dweller of G dash. Jesus, that's so scary. Something just fall on top of me. Anyways, of G dash 123, taking the appearance of a tall white humanoid with with black eyes. G-123-4 irradiated a glow around it. It is to be seems that seems in the dark. It is currently unknown if there is only one or multiple G-123-4 instance, but it is assumed to be only one G-123-4 as the ability to manifest and demanifest outside of the G-123 in a we don't know by censored stud radius of G-123-1 if G-123-1 is moved G-123-4 move along with it once G-123-4 has moved and no ha, ha, enter the vision of someone, it instantly demanifests it the person observing the G-123-4 is currently not being watched by someone else. There is a small chance that they observe it taken along to G-123. Unfortunately, fortunately. CCTVs seems to have the same effect as being observed by a person, meaning that they, that even if not observed by someone else, that along that individuals, individuals within the CCTVs cameras line of sight, they won't be taken. But if G G dash one hundred four is spotted in the room in a room without cctv's observation the, st the statistical chance of being taken as shown by texting is l only as low as 0.23 percent so far only two employees has been unfortunately enough to roll the, the 0.23 percent low though G G-123 can only be accessed by G-123-4 taking them with them once someone has been taken there is no currently known way out can you hear them can you see them someone is watching you the trench bleeder hmm big ass robot <laughs> Anyways, 
the trench bleeder class walker is built for thing for one thing and only and the and one only thing only making as much money as possible the light van zone is full of natural material mineral node and oil pocket and setting up rates at each one won't be incredibly expensive the trench blader was built to fill the role of a mobile oil rig platform and mining platform that's a thing i know this like a few days ago i didn't know the trench blader was a mobile oil rig platform and mining platform i just thought this was a big ass robot just walking around in the lead van zone and like the, the end allowing us to leave the trench dry for resource for, and cash a trench bleeder class walker weight 220.600 tons measuring at a 1500 stud height and a thousand studs length outfitted with a with a state of, of the hard leather camera scanner mounted at the top of its flare stacks it roams the light van zone scanning for mineral oil once a pocket has been found it will walk on top of it and start the extraction proceed once the pocket is empty or its cargo storage is full it returns to its loading dock dropping up its resource and returning to, to duty each French render is controlled by the Navy AI system, allowing them to do tasks autonomously. This means that they can operate days and night without need to crew for for crews to switch between shift constantly, only needing only needing regular maintenance every two weeks. This also means that in the in the event of, of, a, of a black side lockdown, the trench vendor can can keep making money as the lockdown situation. Brrr. Okay, wait, wait, hey. So you're telling me that the trench vendor still makes like still mine things, even though there's a black side lockdown. So especially like when you enter in a game you're literally in a lockdown so basically you're telling me that this trench blender is walking around making money by stepping on people all right weird anyways is being dealt with a skeleton crew of 12 people is enough to keep running smoothly until the AI is operational again due to, due to their extreme weight trench bleeder before I call it the trench blender I don't know why because I didn't saw the end someone called it the trench blender so I was like oh <laughs> would not be able to walk on dry land the only reason they aren't toppling over due to the low density water helping it standing up straight attempting to leave the lead band zone like I don't know if in game if it's, if, if it's possible to see like the top tower like I know you can see like the the base like if I like if I remove the top like that thing. I can only see this but I, I don't know if in game it's, it's possible to see the top tower to leave the advance in wouldn't be suicidal for the transmitter as uh, the sudden pressure shift would implode its light whole instantly 
there are f only four trench bleeder in operation here name our follower trench ble trench bleeder leon after the name of mr shade cats trench bleeder rogues name after the woman uh, who we don't know trench bender lucy lucy is like kind of the main like She's the one in the last door, and sometimes she's the one in the trench, in the, in like the, the life van zone. She's probably the main character. <laughs> Maybe. Because we can only see it two times in the game. Probably, if you're lucky. Anyway. After Mr. Shade is still born, daughter. Trench Bleeder River. After the, the name after the... The man who gave his all in the first encounter against the guardian angel of the Badland. Once the lead vein zone is fully stripped of its resource, all, tr all trench builder will shut down, will be shut down and dismantled for parts and all except, all except for Lucy. Mr. Shade has requested that Lucy specific specifically is to be switched into free row mode allowing her to wander around the trench without any clear money making goal the board of fin finance were very unhappy with this request as the maintenance cost without any profit returns would be high and Anyone on board against this request has been sent to the moat and or fired. Z-212, my analog or Christmas tree. Like half of this is just like tag test text. I cannot know what the fuck this is. So, uh, I'll try to like read like um, non 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 censors text. Z dash two hundred and fifty two hundred two thousand bro. Let me restart. Z dash two two thousand five hundred and twelve code name by analog or Christmas tree is. The Christmas tree responsible for for ruining Christmas, with its first record appearance being on December 20, 25th, 25, 9, 1931. Uh, we don't know about this. After causing eight eighty point four hundred and eighty three point five hundred dollars in damage, we don't know. The bodies of three ghosts. Of three girls of Christmas, we don't know the scourge. We don't know. We don't know the rem the the rain dirt had turned feral. We don't know covered in pine cone. We don't know fear of God. We don't know analog or VHS tape. We don't know. Rolf knows was found 83 miles north of his corpse. Frosty hat was stolen. Teaming up with we don't know Skelly Skellington. Even the Grinch did not did not want to partake it partake in the carnage. We shortly after found this this disappointed. Whoville has been wiped off the face of the earth. Nutcrackers had attacked. We don't know. The express has was found derailed. Saint Nick has per has perished. Christmas has failed, fallen. 
for now, the tips for of the North Pole is to be considered lost media. And any remaining sleigh are to be shot down as fast as possible. It is vital that no presents dropped from the we don't know slant are to be opened by anyone as the destruction will be indescribable. Jeez. Is it the is it the moment? Yep. The prisoner diving gear. I want to show you something. So I'm just gonna read like the first text like like just uh, like the first text right there. So Prisoner Diving Gear, PDG for short, is a modified diving gear outfitted with a remotely detonated modified shotgun shell that works underwater point directly at the user next. Okay, let me show you where it is. If you correctly zoom in, like you can almost not see it, it's right there. That, that, that red thing right there, that's the shotgun shell. So if you, so like, you will read like the like the other like thing but like the shotgun shells is over right here i literally recognized that like a few months ago or a few days whatever so let's continue uh in 1962 during Hado the excavation of infrastructure of the Hado black site a major problem where the convicts being used for lab or trying to leave the left van zone well, the problem wasn't so much that that they tried to leave as when they tried to swim up and out of the zone they'll they they'd get crushed by sudden pressure change the problem came from having to constantly get new convicts and the majority would try to swim away the pdg was designed as a 10 turned if a uh, convict tried to swim away. Stationary guard or HQ could flip a switch and shotgun could, would go off, kill them instantly. After this little modification, escape attempt dropped by nine, 98%. That was the issue. <laughs> Over the year, the PDG has improvised drastically for the work built, just built to work in the in the lead zone. But now it designed it for and can withstand. Is that the one? Is that 1.2 million stud deep? Previously, after detonation, the gear wouldn't be considered lost as the corpse sank too fast to the bottom to the trench before the gear wouldn't be recovered. Could be recovered. Now, in the event that shotgun being is being detonated, the backpack would automatically disconnect from the corpse of the user and float to the surface where it can be picked up by patrol boats and reused. They can also be detached remotely from the user back, leaving the form former user to drown. It will save a shotgun shell, but it will. It is not advised as it can considerably more in, inhuman. It, it should be noted that certain radio waves especially the sound of frequencies, can trigger the PDG to go off without input or block from detonation entirely. It is highly advised that trigger hold operator on a two strike and you're out system. Depending on what severity of the acts committed, however, their PDG may be detonated on the first offense if the prisoner in question cannot communicate with or if to show the an exact sample to a group their PDG may also detonate it on the first offense. Below are the list quota at that permit to use of the PDG. 
the R no, that's not a PDG, that's an RDG. What the heck? Prisoner tried to, to leave the light van zone. Prisoner attempt to escape the black site. Prisoner disobeyed direct order from any personnel. Prisoner enter restricted area without permission. Prisoner picked up any weapon without permission. Prisoner tried to attack personnel. Prisoner tried to tamper with PDG device. P prisoner tried to take off their PGD device and prisoner tries to scramble the connection. What do you mean scramble the connection? Z-96, the mask of sadness, aka good people. <laughs> Z-96, code name the mask of sadness, it's a smiling threatler mask. That be that when worn, it will take off the new the new face and melt a new their body down to a sent sentient meat paste. With its first recorded appearance being on September second, nine six sixteen sixty six, Z ninety six was brought and in and worn during the threat. Recall play as no other comedy mask could be found. The origin of Z 96 is currently unknown, but it has been deemed irrelevant after a performer put on the mask during an act of the play. It immediately began an MOSA proceeds. Shortly after, Z-96 has consumed 710 of the 725 souls present, including the cast crew and audience, which all became a part of them of its mass. Z-96 claw out, claw its way out of the theater. Steering its way through the street during the, its rampage, Z-96 accidentally knocked a street lamp into a pile of hay, which quickly spiraled into an out-of-control fire. Before long, Z-96 had trapped itself in the middle of a blazing inferno, burning the flesh bob to nothing but ashes. The mask was found in the rumble. The, rum the rubble of the building four days later and was stored inside of a vault of a Birking Birkingham Palace. Z-96 was not written down their history book due to the only 15 souls living to tell its story which with no one believing them. The mask was brought brought in 9, 9, 1984 by Urban Tree during state lead auction after having found a survivor survivor's diary diaries which had picked their interest selling for $150,000 total when warm by any species human or animal or corpses Z-96 will start assimilating into a blob of meat. It will then try to seek out other living organisms to consume once enough size has been gathered. Z-96 will seek out safe place and then start to digest its new mass. It will continue to do until it kills by external force despite the massive size it can be it can become can become it it is merrily refresh it if it bleed it dies real z-96 is currently being kept in a storage only brought out during scorched earth tier mission 
The proper way to use Z-96 in the field is listen below. Capture an enemy as a prisoner or retrieve an enemy corpse, place Z-96 on its new host, then lead it to its deployment location where it is released and can then wreck a bot. Then let Z-96 do its thing and at the desired location ob uh, obliteration should it should be know that collaborate note that collateral damage slash death to the local po population is to be expected but this is acceptable during these operations once the area has been cleared off hostile z-100 no, uh, z-96 is to be killed by urban shade operator I have the mask to be clean of mold and return to storage Z-432 Imaginary Friend Oh god Z-432 Codename Limited in Time Imaginary Friend Is a toy remote Consisting of a button that When pushed summon a horrid creature That had fixed Three studs distant from the individual that is that that is always visible regardless of obstruction. With its first record appearance being in early 2020, Z-432 first appearance on sale in convenience store in the new in the New York. Designed by Fun Blocks, it was advertised as an anti-lonely, lonely, lonely, lonely. What the? F wait, 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 wait. Anti-loneliness tool, promising to rid the buyer of loneliness. If I had to say less or ness, kind of same. Thing. Anyways, that's not my fault. As usual, the, the return address of every package leads to an empty shack in the middle of nowhere. After many horrific people, after after many report of people seeing an horrific red creature after using the product, a bitching agent were eventually called to investigate, and eventually found a uh, use of Z-432 instance. All other Z-432 instance were quickly confiscate and brought to the black site. Containment and study later, a fake news story had been published labeling the event that had taken place as mass hysteria. No executions were done as anyone who had used the Z-432 would simply be chalked up as any intention seeker who had been fabrication story for publicity. When Z-432 is used, a voice will emit from remote congratulating the user from using the product. Request they enjoy the next two days with their new very own not so not so imaginary friend. Shortly afterward a grotesque creature Herbie referred to Z uh, to as Z-432-1 will appear 40 studs away from the user. Each individual Z-432-1 is invisible to others even if they had also activated that uh, a Z-432 instance despite Despite appearance, Z-432-1 will not attack individuals who has used uh, uh, Z-432-1 
432 dash uh, instance Z dash 400, 400 bro I'm, I'm losing my words Z dash 432 dash 1 is harmless and will simply follow the individual from a distance Z dash 432 dash 1 is always visible regardless of obstruction so even if individual who has use uh, Z dash 432 and just walk up to the wall Z dash 432 dash 1 will face through at it it has if it weren't there Z dash 432 dash 1 will sometimes communicate with the affected individual but the thing is it say are most not that I'm nonsensical. Z-432-1 will not respond to the user if they try to talk to them to it. And will sometimes cut off the user mid sentence. The voice from the remote and the creature itself has been deemed to be to be the same after 48 hours Z-432-1 will demanifest until Z-432 is pushed again several employees have been requested Z-432 instance for themselves seeing as Z-432-1 serve no physical threat these requests have, have since, sent, since been approved in the workspace. Z-432 most commonly used to prank new employee by those who find the uh, anomaly fascinate, fascinating by those who lonely and simply appreciate the company of and otherworldly creature Z-132 have been deemed of no monetary value and remote are instead being sold at the anomalous auction I'm missing three so Z-132 538 codename abstract art are armless sentient statue made of concrete and rebar like this with their first record appearance being in the middle of 2018 Z-538 were discovered in we don't know Western Ireland and when were when the property owner had report that that a numerous amount of weird con concrete status statues I mean had been, uh, started meaning appearing on their land this wasn't originally anything of interest until the property owner report the statues moving between his plot urban shade agent were sent to check out the phenomena and shortly after found a herd uh, of, uh, of Z-538 moving through we don't know forest any Z-538 instance that could be found were quickly rounded up and transported to the black site con for containment and study the incident was covered up in the news as an elaborated art piece and the property owner were compensated for any damage caused by Z-538 paid for the paid paid for by the statue original artist even individual 
and his D-438 instance, nickname abstracted, abstract T, is, uh, is about a twist of uh, the height of the average person, measuring around 8 to 12 stud tall, an abstract which was deconstructed revealed no internal component beside concrete and rebar used for stru structural stability. It is currently unknown how or why Z-4538 is able to move much less where they came from. Investigations were are currently ongoing on their source so that their creator can be brought in to, to make a more Z-534 uh, move in herd at unusually 25-40 at the time they don't seem to have a goal, any goal on where to go simply moving until they find an area they find interesting and the herd will then rest at the new location for four to nine hours before getting bored and moving to a new location sometimes z-538 instance will falter behind uh, the herd and will then hibernate in the spot where they were lost until the herd returned for them resulted in a stand z-538 instance is still lost in random places in Ireland waiting for a rescue that never arrived these instances were brought back to the black site for found in the wild 5 z-538 was has been deemed for of no monetary value and the attracti are now been s being sold to animalis auction now we get to my my worst nightmare this was literally the hardest to find uh, z dash v zero code name valvo void mass is a gi gigantic mass of nothingness spawning endless sentence puddle spawn from its dark and disgusting Oops. disgusting abyss uh, give me just second I'm gonna go to the toilet real quick We are locked in. All right. Discovered in, on the interior of 30, stun, uh, 30 studs radius, asteroid that fell into the a an Atlantic Ocean in 1991. Z-V0 was was a mere glowing rock measuring two studs in radius. The mass quickly began to expand on its own. And it was transported to the black side before it could reach it could reach critical mass. After being contained, Z V0 kept expanding to greater and greater mass, constantly outgrowing its containment cells. In order to keep to keep Z V0 from expanding to greatly the, the the door and windows from its containment cells are light 
are lit up with anti-degression evaporation floodlights, preventing the further spread of its mass as well. As killing any of its spawn, it is vital that this system is operational at all times. Less than less less the black site would become nothing but a black smudge on the world map. <laughs> Z-V0 is constantly trying to manifest puddle spawn out of its excess mass. These spawn are unusually violent. Record spawn type are as follow. Z V01 small lunch like slug. V Z V02 a, a failed manifest of humanoid figure. A can akin to that of a person. Z V V03. We don't know about that one. Z V04 a four legged creature incomparable to any known specimen. Species, I mean, not specimen. <laughs> Forget what I said. Z V05, a large and more rugged a humanoid figure. It is important when taking void mass for production for product. Is it that that at no point does the content for any void vial come into contact with one other and void mass taken from Z V0 smaller than three studs radius will not turn sentient the, dis the disintegration acid like effect possess 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 pos bro how do you say that word Proceed, proceed by the V Z V0 mass has been vital for the urban shade armory. Each bullet slash shell product produ produced by the urban shade bullet farm is tipped to have thin layer of void mass, allowing the acid to take the the brunt on the impact burning straight through the any forms of cover before it disintegrated tests have shown that the void that a void tipped nine small stud bullet was able to penetrate up to 34 small stud sheet of metal this is what this has been incredibly profitable in the arm trade with either side of conflict buying RBJ ammunition in the large quant quant Cities, meaning the great gain from war for fine tearing. Where are on our last one? So Z-1223 Code name my wife is a headless skinless corpse of my wife up to a metal detain detainer it is currently unknown how or when why my wife was decapitated and struck up to, into the detain further research ongoing my wife was discovered in late 2023 in a cabin in the woods located near gross gross point park in michigan after numbers report of of a declining animal produce population in the local area an incredibly full odor 
originating from the cabin, two local police officers were, were dispatched to the cabin to investigate urban trade. Operative were sent shortly after and both officers had, been, has, had reported that they found the corpse of their wife. Despite neither of them ever having been married, my wife corpse was found shortly after and was transported to the Hollow Black Side for safe keeping from the danger of the world. Regardless of the person's preference, C-1223 is always recognizable to them as their wife. A qu questionnaire was held where two, two, one, 206 urban chain employees of different gender, mari marital status, and preference were shown pictures of my wife, corpse all 206 of them claiming that the picture was of my wife. Wills in the in my wife. The presence has presents any person with feel strong needing to grab a stampler and stamp small animals onto her carcass as as she wished to wear them into order to be beautiful again. This urge only manifests if there is our small there are small animal in the area, otherwise nothing will happen. The list of known animals that my wife wants to be stamped onto her include aquarium fish, hedgehog, squ squirrels, cat, fox, rats, slash mice, small birds, spirit. If no small animal are present nearby, the urge will not manifest. And my wife will remain without her beautiful skin. Once enough animal has been stamped onto my wife, she will return to slumber after 3 or 4 days. The carcass of dead animal will decompose and slash evaporate on this happen. Once this happen, my wife wants to be supplied with, with new fresh shipment of animal that is to be stamped onto her immediately. Despite serving no monetary value, my wife is to be kept safe and soundless want to, to bring upon us the work of God. So that's all of the document in Urban Shade. That's literally every single document in the game for now. They may be more lore about these, maybe or be, but that's the only thing I can um, show for today because these are literally all of them. Anyways, I'll show. I'll make sure to hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you in another one, guys. Um, see ya.